most of them know about that chemical bonds uh, there are two types as a ionic bonds and covalent bonds look at it's in here very careful very easy lesson right this lesson is very very easy right ionic bonds and covalent bonds now when we take when an electron was released when an electron was released electron has negative charge right here same number of positive charge same number of negative charge here also same number of positive charge same number of negative charge now one of the negative charge was released as a result of that now there are more protons than electron that means there are more positive charges therefore this metal charge has a positive ion non metal accepted that electron Therefore, there are more negative charges than this one charge as a negative. Now, what is the reason? We can say we can define the term by this. By the definition of the definition of the reason. How can we write that? The ability of an atom to combine with another atom to combine with Right, the ability of an atom to combine with another atom. Three, two, one. Three, four. That's very easy to identify. Right, that's very easy to identify. Just look at the first two variables. I'm going to divide it. 